what is up how's it going man some crazy news in the world of fighting games but awesome news excellent news as a fan as a lifelong fan of mk and street fighter we got some news that the team at capcom they're up to the possibility hey look at that he says director is open to the ideas of guest characters from mortal kombat now that to me is huge and why well because it's something that ed has been fighting for for a long time but capcom never really kind of just like capcom was like nah nah no thanks and i think it was just the people who were kind of in charge at the time but now they are new people on board in the capcom team especially in the street fighter team and that's huge that is some of the coolest news and actually has now more than ever there's potential for that actually happening because the new team at street fighter is absolutely killing it and yeah things are changing at, at capcom right it's wild and see and especially with nakayama i mean that is super huge that it's like oh my god that gets me excited because Ever since I was a kid, I've always dreamed about it. And now here's the thing. I know there's going to be a lot of haters that just, there's going to be a lot of like, like I, I've been in the FGC for a long time. There's a lot of Capcom fans that just don't like NRS games. They just hate them. And it, it's just like, ever since I was like growing up and I'm like, I just like fighting games. I like Mortal Kombat. I like Street Fighter. I like them both. Why can't they be friends? And the majority of people are like that. There's still some gatekeeping nerds are out there that like, yeah, it's just, you know, whatever. But the majority of people would love to see that. I mean, it's uh, Street Fighter and MK are my life. I, I grew up playing them both. I love them. And to see that possibility is amazing. But, and you can read right here. I mean, it, it's, they're like, well, you know, hey, and it's so great because to me in this thing they talk about they would do it for fighting games to get more people to talk about fighting games to get into fighting games to get more people in the street fighter world to like hey here's mortal kombat and now here's the thing like if a mortal kombat character showed up in street fighter they're like oh there'd be no fatalities guess what i don't care okay fatalities are great they're fun they're the staple of mortal kombat but that's not why i play mortal kombat i play mortal kombat because i love the characters and i love the gameplay for the majority of the mortal kombat games i really enjoy the gameplay you know in mk9 I used to play, I used to do the the no blood code or whatever, and that, that would just, as soon as the match is done, boom, it would just start off to the another. Like, that's what I care about. I care about the gameplay. So if a character comes out and Street Fighter has no fatalities, I don't care. If you just want a fatality, like, to me, gameplay over fatalities, right? Fatalities are neat, they're fun, but after a while, you're like, okay, I just can I get to the next match because I, I, I want to play again. But... So yeah, that's why I, I don't even care. If they could release a T-rated, let's say if Mortal Kombat 9 or X were teen, but this had the gameplay, I'm like, good, give me that. I, I just want fighting games to be fun. I want Mortal Kombat to be fun. But yes, Mortal, the fatalities are the staple of the franchise, but if, if he shows up in Street Fighter and doesn't finish off Ryu or Chun-Li, I don't care. I just want fun. And um, so that'd be great. But now, I'd have to ask this question. Let's say Capcom and, and NetherRealm come to the table. They said, hey, you know what? We'd love it. And, but then Capcom's like, look, we, we, we'd love to work with you, but just so about the fatalities, we don't know. Let's say, can we, can you give you some characters from our other franchises? So like, what characters from the Capcom franchise would you say like, hey, maybe Wesker, maybe some Darkstalkers characters, maybe, the thing to get Darkstalkers coming back would be Mortal Kombat. So what if Capcom says, hey, you know what? I don't know if we have Ryu getting his head cut off or Chun-Li getting her head cut off, but what if we give you someone like um, Donovan or we give you someone like... Um, yeah, I just... Darkstalkers characters. I don't know if they would want Morgan, even though, you know, it's whatever, but Anakaris, Lord Raptor... 
uh, there's some characters that, hey, maybe some Doc Stockers, John Talbane could show up and, and like maybe they'll be like, hey, and then that gets excitement for Doc Stockers. I'm just spitballing here, chat. I'm just throwing out some ideas of what could possibly happen. But those seem like some cool concepts. But I'd like, and now here's the thing, like who would work in Street Fighter? Cause that'd be, but the thing is it, they've done it, right? Like would Sub-Zero work? Even though they said like, I don't know if Street Fighter's down for like to have a move that freezes you and just sets you up for a full combo, right? There's like, maybe they can have it be like Sub-Zero in um, Injustice, right? Where the ice just worked like, uh, like a projectile and maybe had to meter burn it or something like that. But I, I would love it. I'd love to see Street, oh man, I, I just, I mean, I, I do like the new art style now, but my God, imagine just, that team up, and then you get Capcom artists working and doing drawings of, of Mortal Kombat characters, like of Sub Zero or Scorpion or, you know, Molina, you know, chilling with Chung Li. Because I just, just uh, every, whatever since I was a kid, I wish, like, how come Mortal Kombat doesn't have an art book? And I'm like, I, I, I have my Capcom illustration books and stuff like that. Like, Does Mortal Kombat have one? I'd like one. But those are just the dreams in my head. But yeah, imagine if like Capcom says, yeah, hey, here's some characters. You can get Wesker. How about these characters from Doc Stalkers? Maybe even Akuma. I mean, Akuma in Mortal Kombat would... Akuma in Mortal Kombat would break the world, okay? You know what I'm saying? That would just go insane. And I think it's like, hey, it's Akuma. He's a guy who fights to the death. Maybe Gen, but no, Akuma would be... Wow. <laughs> I mean, you know, like Akuma, he's a demon. He's a bad guy, right? He, he, he does, you know, maybe the raging demon into a fatality. Even though, like I said, fatalities or whatever. But the potential has me smiling. And, um, and now, yeah, I also have to think, and I have to ask you guys, what character from Street Fighter or from Mortal Kombat would work best in Street Fighter maybe Johnny Cage Johnny Cage would be sick I think Johnny Cage would be a great fit you know with the um cause like with Scorpion and Sub-Zero yeah they're they're a little dude I god Scorpion's teleport I don't ever want to see that in a fighting game ever again where you have to hold back to block no no thank you okay all right, I, I just don't want to see that again. I'm having Injustice 1 flashbacks of just, uh, yeah, no, okay. Liu Kang, I think would turn would be great. Molina would work awesome. Maybe even Katana, yeah. But man, just a crossover. Just imagine if there's season three and we get like, two Mortal Kombat characters. Ah, oh, man. The smile on my face, that the potential. Right? And I know it's going to be a lot of haters. It's going to be a lot of Capcom purists. They're like, oh, get that out of here. Oh, finally, a Mortal Kombat with good animations. I'm like, come on, get out of here. I, I've, ha I've heard that since the 90s. Just leave it alone. But anyways, yeah, that's it. But the potential to see these games finally crossing over. I mean, you got, you know, imagine this being Molina and Johnny Cage. Huh? Johnny Cage and Sonya. I, 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 and it seems like maybe one day, maybe one day they just like, someone says, hey, we're gonna make them all join hands. Capcom versus SNK versus NK. I don't know. I, I just love fighting games, chat. I, I love them all. Uh, and I just want to see more. But let me know what you guys think of this news. Who do you would want to see crossover? Right? Do you think that Capcom would be like, yeah, just go ahead, take Akuma. Hey, we know what? We'll give you uh, Bison. No, not Bison. We'll give you uh, Wesker. Or Doc Stalker's characters in Mortal Kombat. Lord Raptor with a chainsaw. 
John Talbane, their own version of uh, Saber Wolf, Donovan, a vampire. Come on. Or Dimitri, or yeah, whatever. Yeah. But, anyways, that's been it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys think. I'm excited. There's new people in the realm, in the helm of Street Fighter. There's a lot of potential for that actually happening. Well, anyways, guys, this has been Unruly. If you guys like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. It helps the channel out amaze, immensely. I'm trying to get for that plaque. I'm halfway there. More than halfway there. 100,000 subs. And you're like, well, kid, you got to make some more videos. I know. But anyways, <laughs> thumbs up. It really helps me. I'll see you guys. Have a good one. Peace.